So I wanted to do a video on uh, how the Mega 360 and the Ultrax unit and the Mega side imaging uh, all integrates together while using a uh, Y cable. So, and this is the Y cable, uh, where is it here? Uh, there's the Y cable there. So basically when you attach a Y cable to this uh, Solix 12, it defeats the rear transducer that's using side imaging. So the website's pretty ambiguous of what happens when, when that is defeated, but I just wanted to show you basically what, uh, how the system works and um, how you can get it working. So this is just on the nav screen. You would just touch your 360 uh, imaging screen. And in this case, I'm in this small channel here. It's all uh, rock um, on each side. Basically, a small channel with rock walls, and you can see it very clearly on the uh, scan. You can see the one side of the rock wall and the other side of the rock wall. It gives good soundings. Maybe there's a few little fish there. but um, So this is in the uh, 360 uh, mega mode. And all you do, basically, when you want to switch to side scanning, I'm, in, I'm locked in position right now, but you just push side scanning. It asks that you want to do that, and it's, you say, yeah. And then it starts side scanning using the front uh, uh, 360 mega imaging transducer. So all it does is it just stops the rotation of that uh, the Mega 360 and puts it in a you know in a straight position like that and then starts side scanning. So basically, the rear transducer that the you know the Hummingbird uh, the Solix 12 comes with and all the other whatever it doesn't matter the Helix and all the rest of them, uh, it basically just defeats that. It doesn't use that anymore, and uh, you it's on the the, the uh, Mega 360 transducer. So the only downside of that is, of course, is that uh, when you're on plane, you obviously don't have the Ultrax unit in the water so you don't have mega side imaging capability when you're using your uh you know your rear gas engine um and of course when you switch to uh down imaging uh that is using the uh, rear transducer and same with your 2d uh 2d imaging it is using the rear transducer as well so it's only the uh, side and 360 imaging that uh, uses the, the Mega 360 transducer. So that's how they work it. So it, when they say you, you can't use the rear transducer side imaging, that is correct. All it's using then is the front, uh, the front Mega 360 uh, transducer. So and it, 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 you, you can switch seamless, seamlessly. So all it asks you when you switch between the, uh, the side and the 3D is, do you want to do it? And okay, well, yes, I do. So, and then it starts up. And what an amazing system uh, <laughs> the uh, Mega 360 is. I mean, for, for a little channel like this, case in point, once this does a rotation here, I don't know if we could see a fish on it. Let's just see if there's a fish on here. Let it do a sweep here. Um, no, I don't, don't see any. But let's say there was, and we were sitting here jigging. All you have to do is you push the cursor, you go go to, and then I want to uh, spot lock on that position. And now look at the little engine, the Ultrax just takes you over to that position because it knows uh, knows where it is. And uh, we can go back now to the amazing, what amazing technology. And of course you could go to that position and circle it or um, just tell it to go to that position. I mean, it, it, it's just an amazing technology, you know, and the detail you get, uh, is it's just simply incredible like you could see all the all the scarring in the rocks you could see the boulders there now i'm getting a little distortion here at the back i'm not exactly sure what that is but maybe because we're moving but yeah just a great great system but uh, that's how it integrates basically with the uh, y cable you just push your side imaging and you just have to tell it yes so it's like it's there's nothing to it they should be they should explain that on the website better that uh, the way they explain it is just very confusing. Anyways, hope this uh, helps anyone that's going to be uh, doing what I did with a Mega 360 and then you have your down imaging transducer on the rear. Alleviate some kind of uh, confusion that, uh, that the website uh, doesn't really tell you what's going on. Anyways, thanks.